Hello today, and today we're going to review a watch, which is the Casio Collection W800H 1AVES Men's Watch. Right, so but this is, well, it's not a good looking watch as you can see, but it's not a fashion accessory. Watches are supposed to do its primary function, and that's tell you the time. When this has got the time and the date, it, the day, the month, and the year, and including what day it is. So we're recording this on Saturday, April the 21st, 2018, with the time at 5.34, 30 seconds, right. So it's got a few um, um, different functions on this. It's not one with many functions. It's not one of them Casio watches which can do basically tell you everything. Um, so it's just got four buttons on this. Um, so if you push that button there, you hold it in. This is going to set your time and everything. So you push it again, it re um, carries on going. Once you've set it, you just push that in. So um, this is your mode button. Um, is the camera getting this properly? I don't think it is, but I'll do the best I can. So you push your mode button, so you've got your alarm. So you can set your alarm. Um, so that's your alarm. You've got a stopwatch. So, so it starts, as you can see, the seconds are counting down. Stop it again, it's your split time. You can start it again. You I think, push mode, no, that's not it. <laughs> um, so you push that. It doesn't reset it. Or is it the adjust? That's it. You push your adjust. That resets it. Right. So that's just so it stops it again. That's your split time. I think. Just reset it. So we go to the next mode, which is your dual time. So just say you're heading to America or something on the east coast, you can set your um, keep your original time, but you can also set an additional time just say say you're going to America which may be I think there's seven hours behind so you can set it there but if you're going to California obviously I think there could be I think they're 13 hours are they I, I don't know or whatever the part of the country you're going to you can set um, a dual time so you don't have to keep worrying about resetting the main time so so that takes you back so basically your alarm stopwatch dual time so that's the only functions you've got really. Up here you've got a light. Obviously you can't see that very well. But it is pretty it is pretty um good if it's very dark outside you can it does illuminate the screen pretty well. And here you can change from um twelve hour to twenty four hour time, whatever you prefer. Personally I prefer twelve um twelve hour. Up here, it's got some other additional stuff, but I don't know what that means. S N Z. Oh, snooze. Oh, this is all part of the alarm. So that's snooze, alarm, and what's this? right. If we if we push, um, I think we've got a dual time. Ah, look. So it is your dual time because you've got your normal time down there as well. So you can't see what's going on, can you? I don't know what those SNG means. I never use them. But yeah, for a cheap watch, um, just under 20 quid. You want a budget watch, it's very strong, so it'll probably take a bit of a pounding. You know, maybe consider it. You know, I'm, as I say, I'm not much of a watch person personally myself. That's why I didn't go for anything expensive and trendy, you know. It gets broke, it gets broke, but I think it's pretty strong, so it won't get broke. Might get a few scratches here and there, but yeah, it's a good little watch to be honest with you. It does everything I need it to do. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and goodbye.